Hey everybody, how y'all doing today? My name is Tay, and welcome back to my channel, Inspire Me, where I talk about current or relatable topics, all from a godly perspective, and today's topic is called Added Bonus. Now, I wanted to talk about this because a few days ago, God gave me a revelation. I explained in a, um, a couple of videos, I like to play like this designing game where you interior decorating, like decor and different things. You can use your own actual money to buy decor. Now, as far as me, sometimes I really don't really want to spend my own money. It's like I want to earn money. Either you can earn money by voting or whether you complete a challenge, they'll give you money. So I prefer to earn my money like that and use it to decor. However, sometimes I do be wanting to decor, but like I said, it takes money. And sometimes I don't want to be spending all extra money, my money. So, yeah. It don't come out looking as good. Lo and behold, um, I was playing a game, and then later on, I don't think I was playing at that particular moment, but I received the, I think, an email. I think it said, if you sign up for email, you get this much additional points. So, of course, I was like, that, that's all like I do. So, I use my email to sign up. So, of course, I used my email to sign up, and then later on, I got the email saying it gave you this additional diamonds. Now, if you have money, but also some things, instead of the cost of money, it costs diamonds, too. So, you can apply those diamonds to whatever um, decor you want to use it for. So, when I got the email, when I when I first seen it, I was like, it's like God gave me a revelation, but he also gave me another revelation. But that day when I seen it. I was like, first I was like, thank you, Jesus. Go to God. Like, so it just gave me five thousand dollars. Like, this is very big. Like I said, you could pay for it with your own money, but yeah. Anybody got time for that? But I see this from a spiritual perspective. When I seen this, how he just blessed me with that five thousand diamonds. It's like God was saying, added bonus. I added bonus blessing. I added bonus of whatever promise I gave you, uh, you're expecting. Okay, it's gonna be added unto you. A bonus and i keep thinking about ephesians on um, 320 it's one of my favorite scriptures about um god will give you more than you can think or imagine this is what the email said more diamonds for you more diamonds for you tap here to collect now what god was telling me with that diamonds are expensive they're rare they're beautiful but a lot of people want diamonds it says in order for you to get um, more diamonds to be available to you up here to collect so if you want to experience god's trueness more holiness more blessings a relationship more with him being able to hear him more clearly or just being able to hear him at all because you can't hear him right now so if you want a more relationship with god you got to tap here to collect and meaning you got to tap into your inner man you got to tap into the spirit realm you got to tap into what god put inside of you you got to tap into the holies of holy in order for you to collect more spirituality in order for you to collect more godliness in order for you to collect more being able to hear and understand god you got to tap here i mean what's inside that bible what God's telling you right another revelation we see that your balance has dropped below 2,000 diamonds so as a thank you for playing design home we have gifted you an additional 5,000 diamonds what God told me okay I see that your spirituality or you know how it says in scripture do not faint in well doing well I see that your spirituality has dropped a little bit I see that you feel a little weak. You feel a little faint because your promises has not came yet. You've been waiting and waiting and it still has not came yet. You saying sinners are so-called blessed by their father, the enemy, but you have not been being blessed by your father, King Jesus yet. I see you running a little bit low. As, as a thank you, we have gifted you an additional 5,000 diamonds. So pretty much in order for you not to faint, in order for you to know that your promises are still going to come to pass, no matter if you went in long and long and long and it still has not come, what I'm going to do for you is continue to encourage you, whether you hear a message and it lifts you up. I'm going to um, give you word in the Bible, even whether you read in the Bible and it's telling you something. I'm going to give you signs and wonder as a thank you to pretty much tell you this walk of Christ it's a thank you because you could have been out there in this world like you used to be. But as a thank you, you gave your life to me. You were still out there to this world, but you're not. You're still trying to pretty much hold on. You're still pretty much trying to wait 
you still pretty much trying to have faith in me still. So as I do thank you, as a thank you, I'm going to bless you with more spirituality. I'm going to bless you to the point where you feel the faint, but I'm going to build you back up and shrink again. That's what God told me. If your balance drops again in the future, simply tap on the diamond at the top screen to purchase more currency. Well, God was telling me, if your spirituality drop again in the future, if you're fainting again in the future, if you're getting weary again in the future, all you got to do is tap into the spiritual realm. All you got to do is open your Bible and read the word and get encouraged. All you got to do is seek my face. Speak to me. Tell me how you're feeling in order for you to pretty much purchase more godliness, in order for you to purchase more more temperance in order for you to um, purchase more perseverance glory to god it says don't forget you will also receive your daily allowance of 500 diamonds in your inbox every 24 hours it's like god is reminding you don't forget finally when you, you reach your promises you might be blessed on blessed but don't forget don't think that it just in there you might get blessed the next day, you might get blessed with something else. The next day, you might even get blessed with something. The next day, and here it says every 24 hours. But your every 24 hours in the spirit realm could be you turn around here, you get blessed. You turn around there, you get blessed. It don't have to actually have to be a 24 hours. It could be the next second. It could be the next day. It could be a few more days from now. And in a day, you turn around, you get blessed from here. You being blessed from there. And like I said, it reminds me of Ephesians 3:20. Don't think just because you're getting blessed that it just stops right there. You're going to keep getting blessed. Every time you turn around from the left to the right, from this, you're going to get blessed. As long as you stay in God, as long as you hold, hold on to your faith, you're going to get blessed. Just like with this. As long as you, I keep playing this game, I'm going to keep getting diamonds, getting um, revenue, getting um, currency. Now, if I just stop playing it, do you think they're still going to give me diamonds? Do you still think they're going to give me currency? They might give me notifications to tell me, okay, this is available to you. Glory to God. If you start living uh, on um, this walk with God, same as you just, you used to live for God, but you just give all this away and you go back into this world. Do you think God's going to stop calling you? Do you think God is going to stop giving you notifications, telling you to, okay, come back to me. I'm right here. Do you see what happened when you was in me? Yeah, of course you had to wait. Of course you had to go through certain things. But do you think it's actually worth it living the way you're living right now? Especially when you got hell to pay later on if you continue on doing what you're doing right now. Come back to me. I'm going to give you a notification. I'm going to give you a warning. I'm showing you my love. I'm, I'm telling you. I'm going to give you a notification. Like I said, if I stop playing the game, I'm not going to get blessed with um, diamonds like that and different currency if you start living a spiritual life don't think that you're going to get rewarded for going back to the old man you're not going to get rewarded but you will get notifications of God telling you okay come back come back also too you will get notifications but say for instance you just never answer those notifications at all and like um, months and so years go by eventually they're going to stop um, notifying you. That's the same thing with God. He's going to um, pretty much keep calling you, beckoning to you, telling you, getting you notifications. But at the end of the day, if you don't hearken to that finally, and after the time keeps going on and he sees your heart's not turning towards him, he's going to stop drawing you. That, what you call it? A reprobated mind? A person with a reprobated mind? He's going to stop calling you. Like I said about the chest size, go to he loves. So if a person's not getting chest size, we might look at chest size and be like, mm -mm, I don't want that. I don't want that rod of correction. But if uh, if he's not chest sizing you, that's not love. It's just like if a parent, if their child is not um, behaving and their parent never getting on them, never talking to them, never, you know, disciplining them, it's like they might seem like love, but at the end of the day, I'm pretty sure when your child gets of age, they're going to tell you, you barely didn't show me love. You just let me do any and everything. Now look at me now. If you don't answer the notification, if you don't answer God's calling, you know what's going to happen. 
Sincerely, the Design Home Team, you earn $5,000. At the end of the day, when it's all said and done, you want to get a well pleased by God. Not by people. It's good if people tell you, you know, he did a good job, clap for you and everything. But is God clapping for you? So the, mo the more important thing is God has to be clapping for you too. You have to make him happy. So is he going to be able to say, you earned a way, a spot in heaven. You endured. You you searched out spirituality. You searched out me. And you could have searched out this world, but you searched out me instead. You earned 5000 Diamonds, in this case, you earned pretty much a spot in heaven. That's what I want God to do for me. I'll tell y'all the exact same thing, too. And what God had to tell me, too, when God gave me these revelations and different things, like I said, oh, wow, God, I added a bonus. You tell me, God, you're going to give me an added bonus. Yay, yay, yay. And that's good. But at the end of the day, I got to realize, just because God gives you a word, doesn't mean it's that very second. You know, so, so many things that God have told me, like, it's going to kind of pass that was so good, so great, so good to me, and it hasn't came yet. And it's not saying that it's not going to come. It's just saying it's going to come at God's perfect timing. What could be a whole year to me, it could actually be one day to God. So I'm telling y'all the exact same way. If you're waiting for God and it doesn't seem that you're getting blessed, like, okay, I'm getting these words, I'm getting prophecies, I'm getting this encouragement, but it has not come to pass yet. Don't think that it's not going to come. It's going to come in God's perfect timing. But also, too, like I said, so many videos, see if this video is for you because I know that God gave this to me as well. This is for me, and I'm pretty sure I'm sharing it because I know God wants me to relay it because it can, like, it can be some other people that's actually, like, you know, feeling this that same way or who God wants me to relate this message to as well. So take it into consideration and also seek God. So, yeah. Added bonus, and I thank you, Lord, for your added bonuses. Thank you so much, Jesus. Thank you, God. Glory to God. But like I said, another video is like sometimes I see certain people, especially like um, this of the world, and of course I know they're not getting blessed by God, but they're doing pretty good if you look at it. But it's like God say, your time's going to come. And I just read the inscription today. God was telling me, um, I, I think I was going to read something else, but I was on that exact same, like, you know, book of the Bible. So I read the other part, the part about if if the um, evil one can give good gifts to his kids, how much more would the father give to him, to y'all, for those who seek him? And I said, glory to God, because I had that exact same thought, like, God, so... I know if the people out there are getting their so-called, you know, God, I know you can do it for me. I know you can. And I'm just going to wait and be patient. And I know my time's going to come eventually. Like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Yeah, have a blessed day.